All right, this is my product review of the Hyper Havoc aluminum bicycle, 21 speed Shimano gears. It's got your regular padded brakes in it. Uh, Shimano hand crank gears. It's 21 speed. Uh, your regular old seat, which has actually been torture on my bum, but I've got a uh, towel back there. I forgot to wear my bicycle pants. Uh, I've got the kryptonite chain on here. Uh, it's an awesome chain. It's full suspension. I like this bike because a lot of times I don't have to stand up when I'm going up a hill. Uh, the tires are good. I've got them all aired up. I've made no adjustments to this bike or any upgrades at all. Um, I did put my name on there for decal purposes. But the suspension is actually really good on it. Um, my other bike is a Gary Fisher Zabrano bike that I've been riding for years. I've had it for more than 10 years. But uh, this is a nice bike to take out just on the trails. It's 130 bucks at Walmart. Um, I've got about 40 miles on it and probably 30 of it has been on these type of trails right here, uh, here in Marysville, Kansas. It's the Blue River Trails. <laughs> Uh, and they got 16 miles of trails one way, and I've not exactly taken it, but I've uh, that many miles on it. This, but uh, this uh, this bike I've actually taken on this trail quite a bit, but I've actually uh, also gone quite a bit of the streets. I've done a lot of uh, shopping with the bike, but it's a great bike um, for the price. Um, compared to my Gary Fisher's Zabrano bike, of course, this is more geared for off road. It actually it's kind of like any off road vehicle. Um, not as great on the hills going up and down hills, but in off road going up and up hills and really in the rough terrain, uh, I think the Hyper Havoc has it. It's a great bike, especially for the price. You're looking at $130. You can probably get them on uh, online for maybe 90 used. I did get this one used. It had been ridden a couple times, but this is really just my second day riding this, and I have really enjoyed this bike. Um, I really enjoy the adjustable suspension I have not messed with yet. But right now it's set up for me. Um, I've got the air and the tires all the way up. But I've, I've really enjoyed this bike. I think that uh, you can't go wrong buying the Hyper Havoc uh, for, for this Walmart bike. I've had um, other ones. I've had the, uh, the other Walmart bikes. seems like they fall apart. Um, something goes wrong. They get unrailed. The brakes don't work as good. And I've got to do a lot of adjustments on them. But for some reason, this Walmart bike, the Hyper Havoc, FS uh, 21 speed is actually done really well. So there you go. Uh, that's my review of the Walmart bike that you can actually use off road. The Hyper Havoc, all of, uh, it's not all aluminum, but 21 speed mountain bike. I'm John O'Hara, DIY News.